history every single time you run this race. At the break of dawn on one day every year, thousands of people from all walks of life in every corner of the globe come together to take on the 89 kilometer stretch of road through the valley of a thousand hills in KwaZulu Natal, South Africa. Oh, a little bit out of breath, getting used to the cold and the, the sun coming up there. I'm still smiling. I'll get there. Running with my legion brother, it's his first one. It's awesome. The others of flags take me back to uh, where I come from because we only train flat, but the hills are killing me. It's, it's all about running this thing in stages, I think. The real race really starts now. And to participate in this amazing event, 18,000 runners, it's just, it's amazing. The most amazing race I've ever been in. What are you expecting for the legs and for the, the mind? The legs will start crying by 60, the mind will go on until about 85. And then from there on, it's just the people carrying you till the very end. I've done 45 of these. Yeah. How's it going? Not as well as I would like. The legs are old and they're getting slower and slower. <laughs> what keeps you coming back? Uh, the challenge more than the, uh, the ability to drive finish. I mean, have a look at every one of them here. You wouldn't fall easy. By any stretch of imagination, at least these are ordinary people. This was an ordinary person to, to conquer this challenge. That's Arthur's seat. The legend has it that Arthur Newton, the first winner of Comrades, used to have a break there and smoke his pipe. It's good luck to put a flower in Arthur's seat or they doff the caps. It means that you'll have a good ride in the second half as well. Hey, with your experience, you're going to make it, eh? Definitely, I've got to make it. I've got to make it, I'll be proud. For number? Yes, I get it. Number 20. Yeah. I mean, I'm now, I've got 5th of August, I'm 73. It's an unlikely story. Okay. We're getting there. Getting there slowly. Yeah. One step at a time. It's the race of champions, the ultimate human race. I've been dreaming about it for the last 10 years from the US, and I'm finally here. 18K from the finish, I think. Now we Almost there, and it's my first one, hey? It goes well. No blisters, nothing. My old man's done it twice, cousin's done it twice, uncle's done it 15. It's in my blood, I have to do it. You can do it, come on, man! You know what we learned in this run? You just gotta keep one foot in front of the other. You're right. It's just a cramp. He's come too far, you can't uh, bail now. We gotta go all the way. All the way to Durban. It's the last three kilometers. You just push yourself. It's mind over matter. We have done so far, you can't give up now. You've got to get going! Go! 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 It's changed me, I swear to God. It's made me a better man. The comrades. If it was easy, everyone would do it. Very tough, <laughs> but I just made it. Five minutes to spare. To take on this grueling challenge, that in itself, it says a lot about the character of the person. Comment, it builds people up. This basically tests your body on how far can you stretch it to its limit. You, when you finish it, you feel like you have conquered the world. You feel like you, nothing will ever make you faint. Let's do the countdown! Really the ultimate human race. <laughs>